Okay, I found a little macrame owl. This one's cute. Hello, everyone. I'm at the Goodwill Bins this morning. We made a trip in and we are going to go in and see what treasures we can find. So this is a nice... Mm -hmm. These are nice. I'm going to check these out. Oh, look at him. The little sleeping Santa. Oh, that's cute. I don't... That's cute. I think he's broken. Or... I'll check him out. Hi. Oh, look at that. Ah, uh, it's gone. There's nothing. Oh, it's in. It's already been taken out. That's uh, unfortunate. Those are good finds. The cross stitches are good finds. If you find them unopened in the package. National Geographic. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's probably from the Renaissance Festival. It's a plastic ornament. What is that? Oh, a, a costume. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> Is that Santa? That's different. I don't know. That might be hand, like a handmade uh, Santa. Huh, maybe. Just... Oh, that's broken. I don't know if that was a bowl or something, and it's like it broke. That's a lid. Something. These little bears. Uh, I don't think those are just kind of. Well, that's different. Is that wood? Yeah, well, it's like a gourd or something. That's neat. I like that. Oh, it's different. Unusual. Oh, these are nice. I might take these. All right. Well, I'm on the lookout for vintage Christmas, of course. That's my favorite. But it looks like these are a lot of uh, plastic ornaments. Oh, wow. That is... Now, that's nice. I like that. I hope that's a candle loader. I think it does have a chip right there. But it's not in too terrible shape. I might grab that. Okay, so we found a, some little cross stitching. Ah, that one's not finished. I don't know. That has the back. I must go with this one. I'll have to see if I can find the um, back piece that goes into that. And then there's these are broken, the little reindeer, but let's see. We... That one's cute. And then I found these older metal hooks. Okay, so I stopped videoing for a minute because I found this. And that, I'm sure it's a little handmade uh, cutout reindeer, but it's in pieces. And I found this leg, but I need to find, unless it's just the one, but I don't think so. I think it's going to need two of these. So I'm going to see if I can find that to piece it together. If so, I'll pick it up. It's cute. Look at the googly eyes. 
Okay, and one of the things I'm going to look out for day, today is I'm digging down to the bottom to see if I can find some little small um, things because I'm wanting to put together some blind bags um, or like little treasure bags for my booth. And I found uh, some of these. These are really pretty and they're pins. This one's missing that top bead there for the head, but I did find, oops, see, I did find two other ones here, so I'm going to grab those. These are some cute little ornaments, the marshmallows. They're in really good shape, so I'm going to go ahead and pick them up. Um, I'm not sure what I'll do with them yet. This purse is a Brighton purse. It um, has the tag down in there. I don't know if this is uh, going to be of much value. I'm going to look that up and see what I can find. Jeffrey picked this up for your Kleenexes. There. So this is just a little skim of what I found already. So I don't know if this even winds up, but I like it. So I'm going to grab it. I'll test it later. <laughs> Okay, I found a little macrame owl. This one's cute. It has um, the eyes are wooden beads. And they have it there. So, I'll go ahead and grab that. Because these do fairly well. Let's see what else. I'm still on the lookout for the other leg for that reindeer. We have not come across it yet. Oh wow. That would have that's nice that would have been nice one, but the handle's melted on that. <clears throat> that's a strap. Just something. Check that. Oh, that's neat. That looks old. Aww. My kitchen and me welcome thee. That's cute. There's a lot of uh, wooden cutout pieces today. Someone must have donated their whole collection of those. I like this. This is just a little small wooden block, but it's on feet, and this would be great for using as a riser or something. So I'm going to grab that. A lot of uh, handmade things in here today. This is a whole bag of shells. So I might... Well, we have a lot, but I might go ahead and grab those. Okay. Well, there's some, um, <clears throat> what is some neat things today? It's neat looking. It's made in China, but let me see. It has the tag. Uh, ah, I can't get it. It's rolling around. Pants? I don't know. It's in good shape, so I'll check this out. See, maybe I can find some more to go with it. So, oh, that's neat. I'm not quite sure if that's a votive holder or I'm not sure what that is. I like that wooden stem on it. <laughs> Oh, yeah. We gotta grab the googly eyes. <laughs> oh, that's neat. Okay. Gosh, look at this. I found this little miniature down at the very bottom. <laughs> That's cute. This 
is in rough shape. I really wish it was in a little better condition, but a lot of fading and rusting on that. I still have not found, I still have not found the reindeer leg. I'm still looking to have Jeffrey looking and another lady was going to keep an eye out for me also, but so far, no, we have not found it. Look at this baby. <laughs> I think this is an older candy pack, but it has a lot of fading and wear on that. It's kind of cute though. Let's see. Material. Nice material. Oh, I forgot to mention I'm using my new microphone. I broke down and just got a new one. Well, actually, Jeffrey ordered it for me. I just got it in yesterday, so I'm trying it out. And y'all let me know how you think it sounds. Hopefully, I sound better. Uh, so, I might actually pick this up. Let's, just, let's see. <clears throat> Oh, Jeffrey just found this. Oh my goodness, this is great. What do you think about that one? Wow. Here, I'll take a look at it. Oh, I like this. Okay, let's see what you have. Where do you put, where do you want this at? In the bottom. Okay, he has some other. Oh, here, let me put it right here. I like the color of that too. Let's see, cookbooks. This is a nice one. I have sold some of these, but let me see what year it is. It really does depend how old it is. The newer ones, I don't know. We'll take a look at that. It has a lot of nice. Has a lot. Uh, I love the recipes in these, of course. And then here we might pick it up. How much are books? Are fifty cents each, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. And I said, oh, that scrapbook. Oh, my goodness. Okay, we are digging again. Oops. Let's see what we find. This is. What is that? Oh, yeah. It's not broken, but it's in rough shape. Oh, rust airplane. Yeah, it's rust. Let's see what's in this box. I was thinking it was going to be like layers or something. It's mega blocks. Yeah. What is that? Oh, the, oh yes. I need to pick the, like when you're cracking pecans or nuts or some sort, walnuts, yeah. Aw. Decorative candle, but he is pretty beat up looking there. And that, those, I like these beads. Those are long beads. I don't know that I would use them for anything though. Alright, so you found a vintage golf club. It has a wooden handle. Oh, that's neat. Yeah, that's good. I need, oh. <laughs> Almost hit me with the handle. <laughs> I don't know what that goes to. I don't know if that would have went. Well, I'm not real sure what that would go to. Right, I'm over here checking the furniture out now. Look at that school desk. 
all the furniture. A lot of pieces that, oh, there's another one over there, another school desk. A lot of uh, furniture that, like project pieces you can find here. And oh, look at this chair. That's a good sturdy one. Oh yeah, that's solid. That's a really nice chair. And then there's this one. I have a little one similar to that one. Oh wow, let's go check this. Oh, I like that little, there's a little, like a restaurant table here. That's nice. And then this couch is where I was headed to. <laughs> Oh, look at that couch. Oh, pogo All the pieces are there. That's kind of neat. Uh, oh. Well, yeah, that is a salt shaker or grinder, maybe. <laughs> oh, this is a Tupperware piece. Um has the handle. I don't know if I can find the lid to this. If I can find the lid, I'll grab that. I like that yellow. Well, we're calling the hunt for the lid for that. Yeah, there's this. So, some of the Christmas pieces that were in the bin I found the reindeer in are way over here on the opposite side of the store. So, maybe I can find it here. Let's look. Here, so. I know this is not old, but probably yeah, uh, like that. He's cute. It's just a resin piece. He's a little bit older. This is a nice plate, but this is a saucer for a cup, and I don't know if I'll be able to find it. Oh, look at found the lid. Ah, it's missing that opening piece. <laughs> I'm not sure. Let's see if I can find that. Here it is. I found all the pieces. Uh. 
I'm gonna see if I can do this one handed. I don't think so. Hold on. Okay, I got it on there. And there we go. Alright, this is something neat that Jeffrey found, our family. It's a record keeping book. And it doesn't look like it was ever used. It's blank. All the pages are blank. So we're going to put that with our books. It has it. Uh, you see some wear here, but probably can clean this off. Oh, here we go. I think I'll grab that. Okay. Found this. This is not an older, it's not an old Lisa Frank. This is, I think I just saw it, 2016. But look, it's the water paint or watercolor paint. So, and all the pages um, are unused. So, I'm going to pick that up. And then another little handmade thing here. Uh, let's see. Okay, this I think is vintage. It's, the colors on that is very bold. But this, I'm gonna open it and see. I was trying to see if I could see the phantom. Phantom. Oh, this is neat. Oh, and it has the keys to it. Okay. So I think I can clean this up because it's in really good condition. I think I'm going to grab this for sure. That's where it latches there. That might actually be unattached. I don't know if that could be reattached from the zipper. That's where it would have attached to the zipper, but I'm going to go ahead and grab it. Especially since the keys are in there. Oh, there's, these are always nice to make up, but I have so many of them. I don't need any right now, but there's a whole stack of those um, for organizing your lids or pans, uh, like cookie sheets, plates, but I'm going to pass on those because I have several of them right now. Also bag. Uh, oh gosh, this is heavy. Okay, so there's several of these with a tag on them. So I'm going to look those out and see if those are worth anything. A lot of uh, craft flowers in here. I don't I don't do a lot of craft, especially with the uh, flowers, but... These kind of look like Ashland. I don't know who... Is that Michael's? One of the craft stores carries that Ashland brand. Okay. So another Tito's bag. Let me check these out. Alright, so the zipper does close and it does latch. Um, I just don't know. Like I said, if I can get it cleaned up, I might go ahead and grab that. It's a really pretty, it's in good condition. So. 
Okay, so this is not likely something I would grab, but that's really neat. It's a lamp. Oh gosh, it says to mom and dad. Oh, to mom and dad on your silver wedding from all the family. 27 2nd 87. <laughs> well. Oh, wow. Look at that. So this looks like a... No oh, log cabin handmade piece. And it's a box. But the condition on that's not very good. That is neat. So I thought I would just show you that. Unfortunately, my microphone went out about here. I'm not sure what happened. Maybe my battery died. But I was showing you some items that I collected in this little uh, bent, this little bunt pan. Uh, one of the things was this uh, magnifying glass that had a um, really nice handle on it, and it also had the tag. And I'm showing you there that I believe it's made in India. Um, so I did pick that up. I am not sure what the value of something like that is. I'll have to look that up. But I thought that was a really nice thing to find in the bins. Okay, so here you can see some of the other smaller items that I've picked up to put in this little pan. But I'm specifically looking for this piece here. Uh, this is what I believe to be a Mother of Pearl cameo brooch. And it does look to be older. So this was a really fun thing to find at the very bottom of the bins. I am so disappointed that the sound was not working here because this had to be the highlight of my trip. And uh, I found this right at the end as we were about to leave. And I am shocked that this survived the bins. Uh, there was no damage to it. This is Italian Empoli glass brandy snifter and it is in a pretty blue color and one of the biggest ones that I have seen so this was my most exciting find that day. I will be doing a haul video to go over some of these items that I found in the bins that day so stay tuned for next week for that video. Here you can see we have a cart full I never did find the leg to the reindeer, so sadly I did put him back. I did not bring him home.